Hello students, let us discuss about decentralization of authority, the factors determining decentralization of authority in any organization. Decentralization applies to the systematic delegation of authority in an organization. In other words, it is the division of decision making authority in an organized manner. When the authority is decentralized, it refers that the authority instead of uh, resting in one individual lies in hands of many people. Decentralization denotes division of physical facilities based on place or function. Factors determining degree of decentralization Size of organization Decentralization is suitable for the large-scale organizations. In large organizations, greater number of decisions are required to be made at different levels. In case the management is being divided in departments or decentralized, then the decision can be made quickly and this would increase the quality of the decisions. History of organization Decentralization of authority basically relies on the manner in which the organization has been developed over the period of time. Decentralized authority would persist when in case the organizations represent amalgamations and consolidations. Management philosophy. The top level manager's philosophy or ideology greatly affects the degree to which authority is being decentralized. According to the top managers, decentralization is a method of running an organization that make use of people's ability to create, to be free or to possess status. Availability of managers. The extent or level of decentralization relies upon the availability of managers because in order to exercise the authority, competent and capable managers are needed. The availability of quality managers increases the possibility of decentralization. Pattern of planning. The assigning task of planning activities can be either subject-wise or plan-wise. What kind of subject can be decided, at what level and what type of plan can be formulated. The organizations having designed the pattern of plan may hold greater possibility for decentralization as managers can take decisions within those boundaries of the plan and without referring the other matters which are under decision. Control techniques. The use and promotion of control technique influences the extent of decentralization by assuring whether the performance at different levels and points of the organization is being executed as according to the plan. Greater levels of development and use of control techniques would lead to better decentralization. Decentralized activities. Activities such as economies of division of labor, the frequency of using physical facilities at different places, nature of work cannot be carried out without decentralization. Decentralization of authority is quite essential. Rot rate of change in an organization. The rate of change in the organization also influences the extent of which the authority can be decentralized. In case the business organization is developing rapidly and is having issues of expansion, uh, it needs decentralization of authority. Environment inf influences. Environmental influences also ascertain the extent of decentralization. Out of the various environmental influences, the most significant element in the government regulations over the private business. Thank you.